Hi there. Today, we're embarking on a captivating journey as we step back in time to explore the legendary TV series, The Facts of Life. I'm sure many of you hold fond memories of this classic show. The Facts of Life is a timeless gem that has left an indelible mark on television history. Join us as we relive the magic, revisiting the series with the entire cast, then and now. We'll uncover the original identities and ages of the talented actors from the show and witness how they've transformed in the year 2023. So, without further ado, let's dive into the world of The Facts of Life together. Lisa Welchel as Blair Warner. Lisa Welchel, renowned for her role as the rebellious Blair Warner on all nine seasons of The Facts of Life, ventured into various realms of life following the show's conclusion. After bidding adieu to the iconic series, she graced the screen in the 1992 straight-to-video sequel to Where the Red Fern Grows. However, Lisa embarked on an extended hiatus from acting, embracing the role of a devoted stay-at-home mom and wife. Shortly after the conclusion of The Facts of Life, she and her former husband, with whom she shares a son and two daughters, celebrated their union. During this time, she assumed the role of homeschooling her three children. Lisa made a triumphant return to Hollywood in 2013 with Amadea Christmas and has since dazzled audiences with her performances in three made-for-TV movies. Notably, one of her daughters, Clancy Cobble, made her mark in the entertainment world with a role in the 2016 Hallmark movie, Hearts of Spring, a project that Lisa not only starred in, but also served as an executive producer. Beyond her acting career, this former child star has pivoted towards motivational speaking and life coaching, solidifying her reputation as an inspirational figure. She boasts a literary legacy, having authored over a dozen books and co-hosted The Jeff Probst Show in 2012 and 2013. In a surprising turn of events, Lisa displayed her resilience and competitive spirit as a co-runner-up on season 25 of Survivor in 2012. In 2019, she embarked on a new chapter of her personal life, marrying Nashville-based psychologist Pete Harris. Kim Fields as Dorothy Tootie Ramsey. Kim Fields, widely recognized for her portrayal of the roller skating enthusiast Tootie Ramsey throughout all nine seasons of The Facts of Life. Following her iconic role, Kim graced screens as Regine Hunter on Living Single from 1993 to 1998, leaving an indelible mark on television. Beyond these roles, she made appearances on various TV shows and notably took on the character of a social worker in the 2012 film What to Expect When You're Expecting. But Kim Fields didn't stop at acting. She diversified her talents and stepped into the world of television direction, leaving her creative imprint on beloved shows like Kenan and Kel, Meet the Browns, and House of Pain, among others. In her personal life, Kim found love and happiness in her second marriage to Broadway actor Christopher Morgan in 2007. Their family quickly expanded with the arrival of their first child, son Sebastian, just two months after tying the knot. Later, in late 2013, they welcomed their second son, Quincy, completing their loving family. Kim Fields continued to make waves in the world of reality television, participating in Season 8 of The Real Housewives of Atlanta in both 2015 and 2016. Her multifaceted journey also includes the release of her memoir, titled Blessed Life, My Surprising Journey of Joy, Tears, and Tales from Harlem to Hollywood, which she shared with the world in late 2017. Mindy Cohn as Natalie Green. Mindy Cohn, renowned for her portrayal of Natalie Green throughout all nine seasons of The Facts of Life, embarked on a versatile career encompassing both acting and voice work. While she continued to secure small yet notable TV and movie roles, her true triumph emerged in the realm of voice acting, where she lent her talents to the iconic character Velma in the enduring Scooby-Doo franchise. In recognition of her outstanding work, 
She received a Daytime Emmy Award nomination in 2003 for her contributions to What's New Scooby-Doo. Mindy's acting journey led her to an eight-episode stint on The Secret Life of the American Teenager in 2012, adding another dimension to her versatile career. In late 2017, she courageously shared her battle with breast cancer, a journey she had privately navigated for five years. Her treatment included a double mastectomy, chemotherapy, and radiation, and her resilience ultimately triumphed as she emerged cancer-free. During her healing process, she found solace and support at the 60-acre farm of her close friends and lifestyle gurus, Josh Kilmer Purcell and Dr. Brent Ridge, known for their reality series, The Fabulous Beekman Boys, Nancy McKeon as Joe Polniacek. Nancy McKeon, best known for her portrayal of the spirited tomboy Joe Polniacek, made her entrance into The Facts of Life during the second season. Following her time at Eastland School, Nancy McKeon embarked on a journey in the entertainment world, securing various film and television roles, along with appearances in several made-for-TV movies. One of her significant post-facts-of-life accomplishments was her role as Inspector Ginny Exted on The Division from 2001 to 2004. Additionally, she graced the screen with a five-episode appearance on Sunny with a Chance. Portraying the mother of Demi Lovato's character, in 2009 and 2010. Despite her talent and contributions, she stepped away from on-camera roles after a made-for-TV movie in 2011. In her personal life, Nancy McKeon found love and happiness with key grip Mark Andrus, and they celebrated their union in 2003. Their family expanded with the arrival of Daughters Aurora in 2004 and Harlow in 2006 enriching their lives beyond the spotlight. Charlotte Ray as Edna Garrett. During the initial eight seasons of The Facts of Life, Charlotte Ray graced our screens as the compassionate Edna Garrett, the beloved house mother of the all-girls Eastland School nestled in Peekskill, New York. Subsequent to her departure from the series, a role that earned her a well-deserved Emmy nomination, Charlotte Ray continued to make appearances on various television shows. Her talents shown in episodes of Murder, She Wrote, The King of Queens, ER, Pretty Little Liars, and Girl Meets World. Additionally, she ventured into the realm of made-for-TV movies and lent her voice to television animation projects. Her acting journey also included roles in notable films such as 2008's You Don't Mess with the Zohan and 2015's Ricky and the Flash. Beyond her remarkable career, Charlotte Ray shared her life story through her memoir, The Facts of My Life, co-authored with Larry Strauss. She was a loving mother to two sons, one of whom, Andrew, grappled with autism and dementia before his passing in his mid-40s from a heart attack. Despite her own battles, including a triumphant victory over pancreatic cancer, Charlotta Ray faced another formidable adversary when she was diagnosed with bone cancer in 2017. Sadly, on August 5, 2018, this extraordinary actress and woman of strength bid farewell at the age of 92, Mackenzie Aston as Andy Moffat. In the later four seasons of The Facts of Life, Mackenzie Aston assumed the role of Andy Moffat, a character who found employment at the Over Our Heads gift shop. Following the conclusion of The Facts of Life, Mackenzie Aston, renowned for being the son of Patty Duke, and John Aston and the half-brother of Sean Aston, diligently built his acting career with a plethora of small yet notable film and television roles. His credits span a diverse range, encompassing appearances on popular series like Lost, House, Grey's Anatomy, and Mad Men. Notably, in 2014, he achieved a significant breakthrough with a recurring role as Noah Baker on Scandal. His versatility led him to embody the character Richard Corrigan on the cult favorite series The Magicians. Additionally, in 2018, he assumed the role of Bill Dunn on the seventh season of Homeland. Beyond his professional endeavors, Mackenzie Aston and his wife Jennifer celebrated their union in marriage in 2011, 
marking a special chapter in their lives. Cloris Leachman as Beverly Ann Stickle. In the final two seasons of The Facts of Life, the acclaimed actress Cloris Leachman graced the screen as Beverly Ann Stickle, Edna's sister. Prior to her role on The Facts of Life, Cloris Leachman had already established herself as a remarkable talent, amassing a collection of accolades, including multiple Emmys, a Golden Globe, and an Oscar. Tragically, in 1986, the same year she joined the show, she faced the devastating loss of her eldest son, Brian England, who succumbed to a drug overdose. Cloris shared five children with director-producer George England before their separation in 1979. Throughout her illustrious career, this former beauty queen continued to shine brightly, adding more Emmy Awards to her impressive repertoire. In 1998, she secured an Emmy for her outstanding performance in Promised Land, and later, in 2002 and 2006, she clinched Emmys for her work on Malcolm in the Middle. Her versatile talents also earned her nominations for various projects, such as Raising Hope, Mrs. Harris, and Joan of Arcadia. Cloris Leachman's on-screen presence extended to the silver screen, gracing films like Prancer, Now and Then, Bad Santa, Spanglish, The Longest Yard, and New York, I Love You. In more recent times, she delighted audiences with her appearances in the 2018 Bart Millard biopic, I Can Only Imagine, a two-episode stint on American Gods in 2017, and her work as a voice actress. Beyond her acting career, Cloris ventured into the realm of reality television, competing on the seventh season of Dancing with the Stars in 2008. A testament to her remarkable life and career, she penned her autobiography, Cloris, My Autobiography, in 2009. Cloris Leachman, a true icon of the entertainment industry, passed away peacefully of natural causes at the age of 94 on January 26, 2021. Felice Schachter as Nancy Olson. Felice Schachter portrayed the character Nancy Olson during the inaugural season of The Facts of Life and made occasional appearances in subsequent seasons of the series. Following her brief tenure on The Facts of Life, Felice Schachter essentially withdrew from the acting scene. She pursued higher education at Brown University and later assumed roles as a production coordinator for television programs such as JAG, High Tide, and Law and & Order, Special Victims Unit. Additionally, she took on positions as a line producer, assistant director, and production manager for various film and television projects before ultimately departing from the entertainment industry. In a 2012 interview, Felisa disclosed that she was raising her son, William, as a single parent while working as a special education teacher. Julie Piekarski as Sue Ann Weaver. Julie Piekarski graced the screen as Sue Ann Weaver during the inaugural season of The Facts of Life and made occasional appearances in subsequent seasons of the series. After concluding her brief tenure on The Facts of Life, Julie Piekarski took an extended break from the world of acting. However, she made a brief return to Hollywood with a role in the 2016 independent film titled The Importance of Doubting Tom. Her academic pursuits led her to study biochemistry initially, followed by communications and business at UCLA. Eventually, she returned to her hometown of St. Louis, where she assumed the role of an entertainment reporter for a local television station. Nonetheless, she primarily put her career on hold to devote her time to raising her children. In 1986, Julie entered into matrimony with dentist John Probst, although they have since separated. Their family expanded to include two sons, Patrick and Christian, with the latter pursuing a career in theater, and a daughter named Jacqueline. Notably, Julie Pekarski maintains a close friendship with Kim Fields, her former co-star from The Facts of Life, and she has even spent quality time with Kim's children in recent years. Julie Ann Haddock as Cindy Webster Julie Ann Haddock graced the screen as Cindy Webster during the inaugural season of The Facts of Life and made occasional appearances in subsequent seasons of the series. 
Following the conclusion of her brief tenure on The Facts of Life, Julianne Haddock decided to step away from the world of acting. In 1997, she exchanged vows with Eric Becker, an Emmy-winning technical director. And together, they are parents to a son named Brody. Notably, Julianne remains an active member of her local church community, where she dedicates her time and energy to supporting various fundraising initiatives. George Clooney as George Burnett. George Clooney assumed the role of handyman, George Burnett, during the seventh and eighth seasons of The Facts of Life. Subsequently, George Clooney catapulted into superstardom, solidifying his status as one of the most renowned actors in the entertainment industry. His notable achievements include earning two Emmy nominations and three Golden Globe nominations for his remarkable work on ER throughout the 90s. He eventually transitioned primarily to the realm of film, achieving a multitude of milestones. In 2001, he clinched his inaugural Golden Globe Award for his exceptional performance in O oh Brother, Where Art Thou? Notably, his talents also extended behind the camera as he made his directorial debut with the 2002 film Confessions of a Dangerous Mind. This marked the inception of a prolific career as a director, culminating in Oscar nominations for his writing and directing roles in Good Night and Good Luck. He secured his first Academy Award in 2006 for Syriana and a second one in 2013 for producing Argo. George Clooney's cinematic repertoire encompasses a diverse range of roles, including his portrayal of the Capid Crusader in 1997's Batman and Robin, as well as his involvement in the renowned Ocean's Eleven remake trilogy. He also ventured into writing, directing, and starring in the 2017 film Suburbicon. Furthermore, his dedication to humanitarian causes shines through his co-founding of organizations like Not On Our Watch, the Satellite Sentinel Project, and the Clooney Foundation for Justice. His personal life has seen its share of intriguing chapters, with a brief romance with Kelly Preston and a four-year marriage to Talia Balsam in the late 80s and early 90s. His love journey eventually led him to a meaningful relationship with British human rights attorney Amal Alamuddin in 2013. The couple exchanged vows in 2014 and welcomed twins, Ella and Alexander, into their lives in 2017. In addition to his impressive film career, George Clooney is currently involved in producing, directing and starring in the Hulu miniseries Catch-22. His multifaceted talents and unwavering commitment to both the entertainment industry and humanitarian causes continue to make him a prominent figure in the public eye. Molly Ringwald as Molly Parker Molly Ringwald assumed the role of Molly Parker during the first season of The Facts of Life and made occasional appearances in the second season of the show. Just two years following her tenure on The Facts of Life, Molly Ringwald embarked on her feature film journey with her debut in Tempest, a performance that earned her a coveted Golden Globe nomination. The 80s witnessed Molly's meteoric rise to fame as one of the foremost teen stars of the era, thanks to her memorable roles in iconic films such as Sixteen Candles, The Breakfast Club, and Pretty in Pink. In the subsequent years, she diversified her portfolio by taking on various film, television, and made-for-TV movie roles, in addition to gracing Broadway stages. Her triumphant return to Hollywood occurred with her leading role in The Secret Life of the American Teenager, a series she starred in from 2008 to 2013. Recent times have seen Molly Ringwald in notable appearances in projects like King Cobra and Gem and the Holograms, and she presently portrays the character Molly Andrews on the series Riverdale. Beyond her acting endeavors, Molly has delved into literary pursuits, penning a memoir, curating a collection of short stories, and releasing two jazz albums. In 2002, her marriage to French novelist Valérie Lamenière ended after three years, following an eight-year engagement. 
In 2007, she tied the knot with writer Panio Yanopoulos, and together they welcomed their daughter Matilda Ereni in 2003, followed by twins Adele Georgiana and Roman Stilianos in 2009. John Lawler as Stephen Bradley. In the inaugural season of The Facts of Life, John Lawler brought to life the character Stephen Bradley, serving as the school's headmaster. Following his brief tenure on the show, John Lawler continued to tread the path of acting, albeit in smaller film and television roles. Notably, he appeared in the 1994 film Wyatt Earp and made notable appearances on series like Knott's Landing, Scoundrels, and most recently, Godless. His contributions to the entertainment industry extended beyond acting, as he also delved into the realm of assistant directing, for films such as Excalibur, Highlander, and A Prayer for the Dying. In his personal life, John Lawler entered matrimony with actress Tantu Cardinal in 1988, and the couple welcomed a daughter named Riel before eventually parting ways, Jenny O'Hara as Miss Emily Mahoney. In the initial season of The Facts of Life, Jenny O'Hara assumed the role of teacher Emily Mahoney, but her character was eventually written out of the show after just a few episodes. Despite her brief appearance on The Facts of Life, Jenny O'Hara persevered in the world of entertainment, securing various small roles in both film and television. She gained recognition for her role on My Sister Sam in the 80s and made a notable appearance in the 2003 film Mystic River. From 2001 to 2007, she portrayed Janet Heffernan on The King of Queens and enjoyed a five-episode stint on Big Love. More recently, audiences have seen her as Brina in Transparent and in the role of Dot on The Mindy Project. Her diverse acting career also included a part in the 2018 indie comedy Duck Butter. In her personal life, Jenny O'Hara entered into her second marriage with actor Nick Ullett in 1986, and together they have been blessed with two daughters. Jenny O'Hara's resilience and continued presence in the industry showcase her enduring passion for the craft of acting, allowing her to leave a lasting mark on both television and film. In this journey through time, we've explored the lives and careers of the beloved cast of The Facts of Life from 1979. From their beginnings at Eastland School to their diverse paths in Hollywood and beyond, it's clear that the legacy of this iconic series lives on through the remarkable journeys of its stars, whether they continued in the entertainment industry or pursued different passions. One fact remains constant, the indelible mark they left on our hearts and the enduring charm of the facts of life will forever hold a special place in our memories.